Just don't be a donkey, because right now you want some real donkey shit. Donkey, 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 donkey. So if you ever feel I need to be a donkey, man, hit me with the heat. Did she get donkey in the day? Please tell me. I have become donkey of the day. At the breakfast club, bitches. You're a donkey. Yes, donkey of the day for Tuesday, May 15th, goes to YouTube star Nicole Arbor. Now, I had no idea who Nicole Arbor was before yesterday. And according to Wikipedia, she is a Canadian actress, choreographer, comedian, dancer, singer, and YouTube personality, and former cheerleader for the Toronto Raptors. Now, you can look at that bio and say to yourself, either she's a jack of all trades, or she's just trying to figure things out. Throwing a whole bunch of stuff against the wall and seeing what sticks, and that's fine. That's mm-hmm. fine. Never limit yourself to one hustle. Okay, I'm not mad at her for, for working, but people are mad at her for her latest work because Nicole Arbor just released her own version of the number one song in the country, Childish Gambino's This Is America. Now, we all know what the original version of this song sounds like, right? The video has been viewed or on YouTube over 117 million times, but if you've never heard it, let's get a little refresher. This is America. Don't got you slipping now. Look how I'm living now. Police be tripping up. Yeah, this is America. Hey, guns in my area. My area. I got the strap. Hey, I gotta carry them. Hey, yeah, I'ma go hey. into this. Uh, hey, yeah, this is gorilla. Hey, hey yeah, I'ma go get hey. the bag. Hey, yeah, or I'ma get hey. the pad. Yeah, yeah, I'm so cold like yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm so dull like yeah. Uh. Do you hear the soul in that record? Do you hear the soul in that record? You can taste the Spice Classic seasoning all through that tune. Mm -hmm. It's garlic, salt, and onion powder, crushed red peppers, paprika, black pepper, chili powder. You can taste the collard greens with the turkey neck bones, the fried chicken, the okra, the black-eyed peas, the yams, the fried fish with the Texas peat hot sauce, the oxtails, nigga. We got it. Okay? The mac and cheese, the mashed sweet potatoes, the ribs. Oh, my God. The barbecue ribs, and they season to perfection with some light brown sugar in the sauce, a little vinegar, some yellow mustard, and the best part about it is they're beef, not pork. Oh, oh man. Drop on the clues, Bonds, for This Is America. I'm okay. hungry right now. This Is America. You hear me? Black America. Whole different world over here. Okay, well, in true colonizer fashion, Nicole Arbor couldn't leave the wonderful dish that this is that This Is America is alone, okay? Nope, Nicole Arbor took this beautiful three-piece spicy meal from Popeye's with the red beans and rice, the mashed potatoes, and two biscuits, or as I like to call them, cookies. All right, Nicole Arbor took that soul food, threw it in the trash, and decided to turn This Is America into a casserole. Can we hear some of it, please? This is America. Uh, uh, we'll say North America. Look how we living now. The boys could be tripping now. This is America. Mm-hmm. Oh, got goodness. rape in my area. Mm-hmm. You got a drain? Yeah. The roof is got into oh, your cuz. Hey, this is America. I can't. Are oh, you watching the video? Up. So terrible. I saw it. it. More ass so gas. Yeah, go More ass gas. Yeah, crew. Yeah, yeah. Got an idea. Don't make it with that bitch. Okay. In order for you to really hate it, you do have to watch. You gotta the watch video the video. My goodness. Oh, you should. Uh, <laughs> she created so a meal. Foul. She created a meal for the palates of people with no pigment. Oh, it's a lot of casseroles on this menu: chicken nuggets and mushy vegetables, and minimal to no spices, and lots and lots of mayonnaise. Okay, <laughs> play it one more time. Play it one more time. Oh my goodness! I want them to taste this. This is America. Again. Uh, oh. We'll say North America. Oh. Look how we live in. Oh. Oh. The boy oh. could be oh. More ass gas. Got a lot of mayonnaise for dinner. Let it out. All right. Okay, listen. I would like to salute a young woman named Annalise Griffin. I read an article she did on Quartzy titled... White people's bland food isn't just an internet meme. It's a centuries-long obsession. And she starts the article off saying, humans love flavor, okay? And she explains that archaeologists have found that hunter-gatherers in Stone Age Europe used garlic mustard seeds to season their stew 6,000 years ago. So what happened? How did your European ancestors season your food for 6,000 years, 6, years ago, but now in 2018, why does your potato salad have no flavor? Why is the chicken unseasoned? And why do you think mayonnaise is one of the five food groups? Okay? Or the four food groups? I don't know. Anyway, look, Nicole, I know you remade this record because you wanted to make an ode to women. All right? In fact, she released a statement, and I'm not going to read this whole thing, but she said she was just trying to bring to light women's experiences in a tongue-in-cheek way to give additional glory to what I believe is the most impactful piece of art in recent years. Nicole, that's cool. Your intention is great, but your version is just whack. All right? You can't give me Chick-fil-A 
all right? You can't give me a Chick-fil-A chicken sandwich, all right? A beautiful boneless breast of chicken seasoned to perfection, hand-breaded, pressure-cooked in 100% refined peanut oil, served on a toasted buttered bun with a dill pickle, and then take that away from me and hand me a white bread sandwich with two slices of Kraft Singles and a whole lot of helmets, all right? That's not how this works. Not to mention Nicole Arbor. She once tweeted out, she really tweeted this, I'm so sick of people mad at slavery. <laughs> it's nothing else to talk about after this, but I will continue to tweet. She said, it's so, I'm so sick of people mad at slavery. It's the past. We weren't there. We didn't do it. But what we can do is fix e- economic slavery. Focus on the now. Oh, she really tweeted that mm-hmm. and deleted it. Mm-hmm. And when she got called out for deleting it, she replied, nah, we making them videos now to really get into it. There's a gotcha culture that screenshots little bites in hopes of putting people down. It's lame as F, man. Nah. You know what's lame, Nicole? Eating mayonnaise out of a jar with a spoon. All right? And this remake you made of This, Amer- this, is, this is America. All right, play that miracle with Melody one more damn oh, time, boy. please. Play, play that this miracle. This is America. Uh, we'll say North America. Look how we live it now. Fart on that record. This is America. Ass gas no, on that trash. America. You got a drink. More ass gas on the trash. Listen, man, listen, listen. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Listen, man, I don't want to be negative, so I'm going to tell you the benefits of a bland diet. Oh, boy. All right? They can help treat ulcers, heartburn, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, okay, and gas. And you may also need a bland diet after stomach or intestinal surgery, okay? A bland diet includes foods that are soft, not very spicy, low in fiber, low in fiber, and heavy on this lame-ass version of This Is America. All right, please let Remy Ma give Nicole Arbor the biggest hee-haw. Hee-haw, hee-haw. You stupid motherfucker. Are you dumb? That was horrible. Listen, at Nicole Arbor, N-I-C-O-L-E-A-R-B-O-U-R, I think we should go have a petty party in her mentions, okay? What you want to put in there? You can say whatever you want. She turned her comments reason, off. She did? Just FYI. She did? Yes. Man, that ain't no fun. Why people don't want to play with me? I don't want to play with you. Nobody want to play with you, man. Why can't we play? You're too petty. You are too petty. (laughs) She also once tweeted out that anyone who thinks, she actually tweeted this last week. She said, anyone who thinks Kanye West is anything but a new MLK after watching the See the God interview is just in denial. Jesus Christ. Oh, my goodness. (laughs) All right, all right. Hoffa, who this woman? Charlemagne the God here, and today's Donkey of the Day is brought to you by the law office of Michael S. Lamonsoff. Don't be a donkey and call my friend Michael if you've been hurt in a construction accident. 212-962-1020. That's 212-962-1020. Don't be a donkey. 